Okay, drill number nine is handle control. And in my first video, I called this the pull-up. And that was drill number three in the first video. But some people misconstrued the pull-up. They misunderstood it. Okay. When you're crossing the wakes, you want the handle in here as close to your body as possible without bending your arms like this. You can have a slight bend in them, which might help you keep the handle an inch closer, like that. No big bend, okay? Anyway, you cross the wake, and in the handle control drill, as you come up, you want to keep this handle in here as close as possible. So this requires some effort on your part and some arm strength. Keep it in like this, because you watch all the best skiers in the world, and they've got great handle control. They cross the wakes, and their arms don't go out like this, like beginning and intermediate skiers, or even some decent advanced skiers. Their arms still go out. All the top skiers, they have that handle control right like this before they get ready to let go of the handle and extend. So instead of the pull-up, I'm going to call this handle control. We're going to cross the wake sometimes, and then as soon as we cross the wake, we're going to think about keeping it in just like this, okay? Right in here in our vest before we let go. Extremely important. We'll try it now. Okay, in this drill, I'll run this in slow motion for you. Pull-up or handle control is a product of a good body position right here. See, I'm coming to the wake. The hands are close to the hip. The chest is up. The shoulders are back. And if you have that technique, you'll get this arm movement right here. In other words, you can see my left elbow bent. And this handle is in here standing close to the vest. That's pretty important. All the best skiers do this. And this isn't necessarily a strength move. It's a technique move. And you can see children and uh, women skiers doing this as well if they have good technique. So we'll speed it up here and we'll do a couple more of them. And you can see I wasn't trying to turn there. I'm just trying to work on this one thing only. And that's the benefit of doing these drills that break down slalom into all these little components. It gets you concentrated on that one component you want to change. So we'll just do one more of these. Nice slow lean in, water breaking at the front of the binding. Coming into that wake in a decent position. And keeping that elbow in right there before you release. And that's handle control or pull up.